welcome back and yes we are still defining ships what ship are you in what ship are you in we have situation ships relationship financial ships there are many ships but you need to define before we go before we went to the break you were talking about uh, the star tool that we can actually adapt into our lives please just share a little bit more about that you know one thing about life is that people are not hidden day by day people continue to expose who mm. they are when I'm talking to you right now, you already have an idea of the kind of a person that I am. If you're talking to me and I look to the side, you can already pick up that I'm communicating with you. Mm -hmm. The things that I talk about when I'm sitting and spending time with you, things that I'm interested in, things that I like, things that I dislike, I am communicating with you every day. That's true. So that's the reason why people spend time together in relationships mm. but we need to use the time together to observe if you are not calling me who are you talking to all the time <laughs> if you don't want to spend with time with me mm. where are you spending your time mm. it's things that are already a given to me mm. there are certain que answers that people are waiting for whereas they have it already to make their own decisions. Yeah. But no, 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 sorry. So we'd rather delay the decision mm. and our choice mm. because we want to belong. Ish. People want to belong. People want to be accepted. People want to have a place where it's like they feel that. It's like a if you're not in a relationship. If you're not in a, in a relationship. Yeah. You, you get what I mean? Yeah. So it's very important that we face the reality that we are faced with. Mm. And as individuals start taking full responsibility of ourselves, because we cannot blame other people for what we are going through, what they are doing. Yeah. We might not control what they are doing, mm -hmm. but we can control yes. our response yes. to yes. what they are doing. Yes. Because if we don't control our response, if we don't show that, you know what, I'm actually not happy with what you are doing, they continue mm. because to them, this is an okay in our mm. relationship. Yeah. Mm. But I actually need to stand up and say, hey, mm. whoa, there's a boundary here. You're actually crossing a line that you're not supposed to be crossing. And it's very important that we communicate, but it's very, mm. because no one will take responsibility of you. Mm. As people, the first responsibility is to ourselves. God has given us power of yeah. control here. Yeah. He might not call me, he might not tell me what his plans uh, even though I ask where are we going we are in a bus say <laughs> we jumped into this bus where is it going yeah. no let's see mm, and then let's see let's we'll see. see how it unfolds and the sad part Toriso is that even in the church you find the guy saying no this is where you hop off sure I'm marrying another girl. Oh, that is so but you've been in the bus I'm in two girls <laughs> you, you get what I mean yeah but it's our responsibility to protect ourselves. I hear you. It's our responsibility to control. Mm. It's just life. Yeah. It's purely life that there are things that will happen beyond our control, but those that are in our control, we must take, we charge, must take charge of them. And take our position and ensure that we fight for our lives, we protect ourselves, yeah. even from the pain that other people might want to inflict mm. in us. Wow. They are saying setting a boundary is very key for yourself. You know, you have to set that boundary. A no must be a no at some point. Uh, Mr. Majie, how do we define this ship in a form of how do I know what type of a ship I am in? If I want a relationship, or let's say I want a situation ship, do, I have to, do we really have to agree together that let's do a situation ship? How does this ship work? <laughs> How can the two work <laughs> together yes, unless they agree? Okay. <laughs> so if you saying I need a situation ship, you know, a situation ship is that where you you get into it because of circumstances. Mm. Okay. You know, you 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 are in a in a situation that actually you can't be able to manage by yourself. Mm. It, it might be a whole lot of things, family issues, you know, maybe um, economically you're not doing all right, and you are thinking, you know what, I need something that would at least bring that bit of a balance. Okay. Now, you get into it not because you love the person, but you are trying to run away from your situation. Hey. And hey. 
What if he or she doesn't know that you are running away from certain things and you want to be with this person just so you can get away from your family that is dysfunctional? Mm. So you can get away from your situation that is not working mm. wherever that you are. Yeah. Or else you are in another dysfunctional relationship and you're thinking, let me rather try Ooh. and before you even close this one. Eish. Now, situations around you are forcing you. You know, Tori, so the, 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 the the time is ticking, the clock is ticking. Mm. You know, you are at this age, you need to have a child, you mm. need to have a man. Need... Now, the situations around you are putting pressure. pressure. Yeah, yeah. Now you're thinking, you know what, let me rather just go for any... Tom Deacon, yeah. <laughs> at least I will have a man. At least I will have, you know, a place to stay. Yeah. At least I will have that financial support. Hey. At least I will be out of our that dysfunctional misery. family mm. kind of a situation or that abusive relationship. Yeah. Mm. Now, situations are forcing you to get into that. Mm. Now, imagine if you had to say to someone, I like the fact that you said people know what kind of sheep they are in. Mm. But do they communicate yeah. it to the next yes. person? I'm only with you because I'm running away, but I'm not going to tell you because if I tell you that I'm running away from a dysfunctional you family, might, yeah. you might not take me in because then you'll realize, no, you actually don't love me. Hey. You just want to run away from, from your situation. Mm. Now, she's in a situation ship. She thinks she's in a relationship, hey. but I'm running away from my situations. And as time unfolds, sometimes we even ignore the signs mm. that, you know, how is this person talking to me? The only thing I'm thinking about is the realities that I run away from. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to go back there. It doesn't matter what the faults are. Hey. I'm staying with this person because here is better than where there. Where from? Mm. Where born into? Mm. Now, you find yourself stranded, frustrated, and now when the person finally realizes that, am I really in a situation or am I in a relationship here? Because as you grow and get what you need, get what you want, you are going to grow out of this person. You're going to start behaving nasty. Mm. You know, sometimes you'll even try to, to, to find ways just to get rid of them. Mm. Why? Because... You were not with them because you love them. You were forced by situations. Mm -hmm. It is important that you do tell, Hey Muna, I'm running away from this and this and that. It's either you take me in and we see if this thing will work or what, and see if that person will I agree doubt. to that. <laughs> they will not. That is why we get into it, whereas we, we get into it, we don't express those type of, mm. of, of, um, of situation mm. to the next person. Yeah. And also, you do have those conditional ships. You are saying, you know, um, he's not calling you, he's not doing the... Who are saying, Bona, don't call me. I, I will call, call you. you. <laughs> he will take time to call you the whole week. Sure. And I know a whole lot of ladies are suffering from this syndrome. She will keep her phone here on the lap. Waiting for that call. Waiting for that call. Sure. And Refreshing. also, the, 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 the demon in her will be like, call him, call him, now. call him, call him. <laughs> okay. And you, you, you let go of the anointing that you have as a woman that ah. God has given mm. to attract a man. Okay. But now, you are now selling yourself short yeah. because you need this guy. But this guy is not showing any interest mm. that much to show you Horemona. Actually, I know where I am taking where I'm going as a man and I know where I'm taking you. <laughs> and you find yourself in that conditional situation where you don't know whether to visit him or you don't, because hey. if you visit him unannounced, then it's gonna be an issue. You know, sure. you don't touch my cell phone, you know, it's mine. Wow. So conditions around that. Let's Do go you agree with that? And we will continue more. Let's, yeah, we will talk more about these conditions that we have in our relationships because you don't know whether you are in which ship you are in, right? So we'll talk more after the break.